Despite the actions of the enemy, the president of Ukraine has made the decision to continue functioning. This was the this year. Okay, thank you. In the press. Yeah, if we can. Okay. Continue. Yeah. Thanks so much. We had the last part about the damages in, in, in the city. Yeah. 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 About the consequences of air attack, I would like to leave the floor to Deputy Head of the President for the General uh, Policy uh, of the Let's see. Also, some about the whole situation in our region and then so first of all, uh, it is a war of high intensity and constant war against uh, um, the civilian population of the country. Uh, today, it's uh, 740 days of uh, big war in Ukraine, and uh, we have um, a large amount of damages uh, for a different object, critical infrastructure and civil infrastructure. Mm -hmm. uh, residential infrastructure suffered the most, and as you can see, that the number is more than 220,000 objects where with people, families, and children. Uh, more than 22,000 uh, of this uh, is a high rise building. More than 11,000 of objects is energy facilities. And um, educational sports institutions uh, make up about 4.3,000.